As a senior in high school, I began to ask the Lord, what is it that you want me to do with my life? And I was attending a Bible study at that time that really encouraged the women in the Bible study to pray daily, a rosary, attend Mass, and to read the Bible um, very often. And so I was really growing in my relationship with our Lord and still asking that question. But the beauty of the Bible study was also that I had to drive about 20 minutes each way to get to the Bible study. And so on those drives, I took it as an opportunity to just talk to our Lord um, from my heart. And I remember as I was praying in the drives, asking your Lord, okay, what is it? What is it that you want from me? And the sense that I had deep down uh, was the word more. That the Lord was asking more of me, but I didn't really know what that more was. And I was really, to be honest, really afraid of what the more was. Fear of the unknown and fear of, well, really, who does this? Who, who becomes a sister? And so I attended college for a year at a Catholic college and was really brought into community life with others who were discerning religious life and um, continued my prayer life with our Lord and growing. And again, that nagging question of, okay, Lord, what, what is it that you want me to do with my life? And again, this sense and this fire of the response of more, that in a real sense, I could see that my desire was that I wanted more of him, but that he wanted more of me. And after my freshman year of college, I was a catechetical missionary with Totus Tuus for the Diocese of Lincoln. And that summer I was praying uh, with some high schoolers during a Eucharistic Adoration Night and was praying in front of the Blessed Sacrament and opened up my Bible to a book that I knew existed in the Bible but had never read before. And it was the book of the Song of Songs. And I began reading it and really truly the, the, the words just really seemed to come out of the page of the Lord was, was speaking them to me and, and speaking them as, as his letter of love to me. And he was really saying to my own heart, arise my beautiful one, my loved come away with me. And it was in that moment that I really began to see that my fears can be so, so great and my fears were great of, of the unknown and who becomes a sister, but that our Lord's love is more than my fears. And it was in that moment and in the moments that follow, even until this day, that I realized that my fears in life can be great but his love is always greater, and that's the more that I was looking for.